great build from the ratings today. A hard, a hard loss to take considering you came so close this, this season and last season. Can you tell us your emotions about the game? Yeah, I think we're just really disappointed that we let Saracens get onto a bus in the first three teams. But, you know, we've got to learn that you can't allow some card at this level to come and put that many points in you because it was only a real hard goal to come back. But still, there's, even though there's disappointment, there's a lot of pride about how we finished that game. Um, and so I'm really proud of how the girls finished and like, at half time with the team state that's just out there. I'm trying to show a reflection of ourselves and I think that we did that. I think anybody who watched today will say that that was a huge statistical battle and that, and that comes from the, the foundations that come to lay now, the work that girls are putting in on, off the pitch and it's delivering on the pitch and it's only getting bigger and better in terms of transparency. So then, you know, games like today, you know, even though the first half said one still the second half said another three, it's a really exciting time for women's rugby to be involved in it and the strength and the depth that's coming through and yeah, it's going to be exciting to next chapter of it. And then she's been one of the front runners in the terms of the women's game. And she's hit to the girls and the, and the men on, on at the street and you call measure and uh, the game changer, all those sorts of extra things that this club is doing. So it must be fantastic to be a part of it and also just bring them next season and, and take these losses and keep learning and building on them. Yeah, I mean, we're really proud of the work that Harlequin do. They really are putting, you know, a stamp on the game and saying, you know, women are going to be on the car of the men and, and they're happy to say that and put themselves out there. So, yeah, we really had all the work that goes in and, and that's probably another reason why we're quite disappointed because, you know, we wanted to do it for everybody at the two, for everybody at the two, the men that are massively behind us. And so, you know, that adds to the, adds to the disappointment. Um, but I have no doubt we've got a really young side and we have no doubt that, you know, this squad is just going to keep on getting better, getting our phones to top forward and then, you know, hopefully getting back into finals.